So before we go into any details, we actually have to understand what the process of biocatalysis really is. Biocatalysis is the process where you take whole cells or enzymes in order to carry out reactions, which are actually quite difficult to carry out under normal lab conditions. As I just said before, there are two types of catalysis. We have whole cell biocatalysis, which is generally cheaper as you can just cultivate your, uh, for example, E. coli in the lab. The thing is that it tends to be quite expensive in terms of equipment as the equipment tends to be quite sophisticated. However, you can actually use them for reactions that have more than one step, which is actually going to give you a better yield. But at the same time, because you don't only have the actual enzyme that you require for the reaction, you actually have all of the cellular components. Uh, you're going to lose some yield as well, because uh, at the time of the purification, you're going to have to carry out more larger purification. We also have enzyme catalysis which is a simpler reaction apparatus and it gives better yields because you actually have the pure enzyme. However, sometimes it tends to be more expensive because enzymes tend to be quite unstable under normal conditions because usually you have to store them under really, really cold conditions, for example, using uh, freezers that actually go to minus 80. So you actually have to set up your reaction in order for it to work properly without denaturating the enzyme. 